In terms of foundation, I think it is objective. But later, uh, when it circulated and over all over the world, it becomes all the subjective. So, welcome to Saft. Hi. And uh, so, the question that we are floating today is truth. Hmm. Is a certain things objectively true or rather fundamental? Is truth completely objective or is it subjective? Yeah, see, uh, truth is uh, what I think that it in some cases it is objective and in some cases it is subjective also. Like uh, if I consider is uh, the debates, uh, the debate, debate shows and the group discussions and all, often we place opinions there regarding any kind of issue related to current affairs or anything. Uh, so when uh, we are placing any issue, see I personally or you personally, uh, when you are placing any issue, you are thinking that, uh, that the, the opinion which you are placing is true. From your part it is true. It might be uh, wrong from my part. So in that case it is subjective. But uh, the, uh, that is objective in certain cases like the facts, the original facts which uh, you, cannot, uh, you, uh, you cannot make it wrong anyway. So those things uh, are always true. Means you can visually you can see that uh, it cannot go wrong anyway. So it is true. Like uh, there are certain uh, current affairs like the mal malnutrition cases and the war war things and all. Those are always true. Those are uh, covered by medias also in terms of pictures or any uh, information or anything. So those are objective. So, so when you said about the debates, how a person brings mm -hmm. out an explanation yeah. and how it can be true for one person, not the other person. If, if the person is uh, propounding the, uh, the debate argument, mm -hmm. if he gives enough evidence, don't you think that the okay. other person might say, okay, my point is wrong, he is true, his argument is true. Yeah, right? yeah, that can be done. That so, can so, be done. So in that case, that would be objectively true for him as well. Yeah, but uh, it is subjective also like, uh, uh, like, agreeing, uh, like agreeing to the motion of the statement. Suppose the statement is uh, not related to uh, current affairs, but it's a certain uh, kind of a statement or uh, based on a, uh, a thought, a, uh, a thought of a person. So, uh, if you are debating on that thought, it might be true for someone and might be wrong for someone. Or it, uh, the one who, uh, who, who thinks that this statement is true, he can justify in his own ways. And the one who is thinking this statement is wrong, he can justify in the other way and say that no, this is wrong and uh, this part is right. So in that way it is subjective. But eventually, don't you think with a proper, unbiased, unprejudiced analysis of the arguments, hmm. with such an, with such an yes. analysis, don't you think eventually you can reach an objective outcome? Because that's objective. what we see, what, that's what we see in the courts, in the judiciary, yeah. the prosecution big argument. Yeah, the see, in, the, in the courts and judiciary or you can say in the news channels and all, those are very realistic. Those are based on the things which are taking place, hmm. which are so, taking so place So eventually they can, they are bringing arguments yeah. and based on the arguments we see, oh, this makes more sense, this is more rational, this is, yeah. this, this is more believable, this is more true. So, like see, uh, it can be subjective, uh, I'm just uh, hinting in one point, like, uh, mm, uh, a decision, say, suppose a decision, not a decision, a statement only say, it can have some pros and some cons. Hmm. So in that way, it is subjective I'm saying. So if a person is focusing on the cons of that thing, uh, whatever may be the statement, so he might say that uh, this uh, is not right, this cannot take place, this is not right. So another person might say, that, no, this can work and, and this is right, Th this is the truth. So in that way it is subjective. So it's, it's based on the perception. Yeah. So it's the, the, thing, the, the the argument or the fact can be objectively true, but people they have certain bias. Yeah. And because of that their perceptions are maligned and they think of only the one part or the other part. Mm -hmm. But but you agree that the uh, argument can be true, objectively true, yeah, yeah. but people perceive it to be subjective. Yeah. So in that case truth has an objective foundation. But people perceive uh, it to be the other way. So once we give them the argument, they can agree. Yeah, in terms of foundation, if you say it, uh, it might be objective also because as we know, the term truth is like uh, the things which are occurring correctly or means uh, the things uh, which are right absolutely means which is occurring means you cannot uh, uh, you cannot uh, concoct a story behind that. So that is true. So. In terms of foundation, I think it is objective. But later, uh, when it circulated and over all over the world, it becomes all the subjective, varied from person to person, depending on uh, several fields and all. Okay, let me ask. Uh, are you a flat earther or a 
a normal earth believer is the earth flat for you or is the earth a globe for you it's a globe for me it's a globe for me it's a globe for me it's subjective so, yeah but but the thing is the flat earth say well they, we look at the earth the earth is flat hmm. we see the sun moving yeah. we don't see the earth moving so they look at one thing they look at one side of the argument and they say well the earth is flat but we look at a a, 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 a gamut of our arguments a gamut mm-hmm. of evidence gamut of data satellite pictures images uh so solar tis all of this mm-hmm. we look at all of this and we say well this is the argument the earth is a globe it's not flat yeah so we know that the earth is objectively or a globe and surrounding the yeah, earth rotating if we move to the uh, the traditional beliefs uh, during the times of galileo and all mm-hmm. that time the people used to believe that the earth is flat even even today there are flat earthers <laughs> yeah and last year there was the yeah, first like, flat earthers uh, convention in they canada they have lack of knowledge and everything yeah but that is because of a subjective perception of the truth yeah but when uh, when it is coming uh, like you said initially that uh, if one is placing with a proper evidence and all automatically the other other side of the or the other group has to has to conclude that no the one which he is placing is absolutely true and what we are saying is wrong so so uh, that was subjective initially and mm-hmm. became objective but even also when you are going with that assumption okay we are going to wrap up here hmm. even when you are going with when someone is bringing an argument yeah. we have a foundational assumption and that assumption is that evidence is objectively true hmm. for example when Correct. we say when we say you know, for example the earth thing hmm. we say oh look at this the the, the pace of the moon or oh, the the direction of the where the moon is moving or how we are moving let's hmm. something like that we assume that okay that is objectively true for everyone yeah so with the evidence we assume it's objectively true for everyone and with that we build up to see whether it's subjective or objective so hmm. we st- for a person who thinks truth is subjective hmm. and even for a person who tries to prove things is subjective he whenever he is bring an evidence he is assuming it to be objective so that like that person also will understand it and relate it in the same way yeah so in that case again coming off don't you think it's more reasonable to assume that the truth at the foundation level is more objective yeah as i said that and also that uh, if i consider the term if i focus on the term then it is objective truth is truth is an objective yeah level. but later if we say uh, from vary, it might vary from person to person it might vary with regarding the opinions and all with perceptions, yeah, with perceptions and all actually it can be this objectively true yeah. perceptions change all right thank you thank you for your valid thank you